Super Metroid Battle by Banana Oyaji, released September 21st, 2004. Um, what did, what else did you make? I know we've seen that name before. Oh, you were the one behind the earliest ROM hack by another Super Metroid, and I did enjoy that. Now, this is apparently a boss rush. I made to try the performance of 0 0.15 and Smile version 0 0.1. Damn. Smile 0 0.1? That's how you know this is ancient. The content is the game of the boss battle only. So basically, it's a, a boss rush. And it's got three and a half out of five. I mean, it's gotta be decent, right? Three and a half? So let's, let's go take a look at this. It's vanilla with, ex with exactly one chocolate chip. <laughs> okay, that's a that was a funny one. A good one. <laughs> oh man. Alright, let, let's go. I'm not sitting through this. Can't make me. How do they pronounce SR388 in Japanese? Is it SR388 or something? I don't know. I'm guessing series is vanilla. I'm not expecting series to be any different. Yeah, I'm a liar. It's different. Didn't we see this setup though? In another hat? wanted sprinkles yeah maki why not the sprinkle you got something against sprinkles you know i haven't had an ice cream cone in a while let alone with sprinkles like a soft serve i miss having soft serve i don't think they have vegan soft serve i could be wrong though <laughs> yeah, we gotta wait until 2005 when we get to uh, redesign. I imagine when we get to Super Metroid Impossible, that's vanilla ice cream, <laughs> but with habanero peppers added to it. Speaking of peppers, I hear there is now a hotter pepper than the Carolina Reaper. I don't remember what it's called. I want to say it's, uh, the Devil Sump. First of all... Did it rain? It's all flooded. Uh, we need more. <clears throat> Morph? No. Morph? No. Charge. Oh no, we got the slow, um, what you call it? The slow animation because, yeah, it's just water physics and stuff. There's the morph. Someone forgot to close the valve in the bathroom. Yeah. That's exactly what happened. I don't want to go back to the ship and check underneath that that morph tunnel, but no, nah, not yet. Ooh. Missile. Alright, let's go back. I, I I need to. I need to check what's under that morph tunnel. 
I'm gonna guess it's like a green door. But just for peace of mind, you know? Why does the background look like that? I can't get back on the ship? No, I can't. Hang on. I, I hope. No, my ship! No, I want back on my ship. Oh. Okay, well. Guess we need bombs, if not speed booster. No. I don't think speed booster. I don't know if speed ball was a thing back then. Was it? I don't remember. No, wait, I think it was, because didn't we play um, a ROM hack that actually required speedball in one section? Um, we gotta kill everything here, I think. I'm appreciating the fact that there's effort put into this hack. Not that we haven't played any hacks that didn't have, like, effort or anything, but... <clears throat> Just saying. This one definitely shows <clears throat> considerable effort. Spore spawn! I mean, this hack is called Battle, so it's a boss rush. That's the first boss we fight. Yes, Maki, at least it's not vanilla. the bosses were buffed either which is fine by me really oh, I, I do have charge beam don't I oh, I didn't kill you Oh, that door's still open. Can you imagine if I got knocked into the door by mistake? And reset the whole fight? That happened once in, uh... Mission Rescue, and that pissed me off, really. But vanilla good ice cream? I mean, vanilla is a... is... very much a good and underrated flavor. I feel. Super Missile... Okay. Over this way. I feel like Crate is over this way. Anything up here? Phaser! Hey. I'm guessing we, we get like... Like a lot of the items that we normally would before the next boss. I think. Can 
Can I get a super missile? Guess not. That begs a question though, don't we normally get high jump before parade? Let me go check the other the other side here. What's up, Desi? I knew it, we do get high jump. That would mean the next boss after Crate is more than likely Crocomire. Why do I consistently miss the Hey! Why'd you open your mouth again? I've really been messing this up though. Suit, meaning no hell runs needed. Wait. But how do we get to Norfair? Unless there's a door somewhere up, up above. No. Had to make sure. Why is that door locked? Oh, they added an item! Another missile. Okay. And this implies an elevator should be there, but it's actually not. <clears throat> On the bright side, we can save. Guess we can re reach our ship with the high jump. Okay, we can go here next. Wait, we're not going to the wrecked ship next, are we? No, I don't think so. I guess we need power bombs for whatever. Ooh, I want that. Hang on. Speed booster? Speed booster. But stands to reason that down here will lead to Norfair. Dude, I'm actually liking the way this hack is set up. It's already looking like a 4 out of 5 for me. Hey, look at that. And we're gonna get Rapple Beam. Probably after Croco. You little... Oh, missile. We've yet to find an E-Tank. 
so is that gonna be a problem? How do I know where to go, though? Like, where is this gonna take us? Okay, we need grapple. So that requires... Okay, Proco is definitely down there. So I'm gonna guess over here is Speed Booster. Yep. Oh god. I just realized something. Lava is gonna rise and we have to escape quick. What was I worried about? Definitely down there. Yes. Yes, I am. Alright. Taco time. Oh, they changed the room a little. I can respect that. <coughs> Should probably farm from for some health here. I'm not going that way. We do not have the energy to survive this acid bath. <clears throat> I'm calling it though. It's gonna be a uh, E tank across the way. Our first E tank, I hope. Not unless it's Ice Beam. I don't think it's Ice Beam. Hmm, <clears throat> grapple. No save point outside of our ship. I mean, I imagine it has to be an E-Tank across the way, right? Especially if we're gonna... yeah, see? Especially for, like, Shine Sparking. Oh, goody. Right into the damn soup. Don't have uh, power bombs though. Hmm. Let's go this way because we can get an item this way using grapple. Oh, 
Power bombs! How about that? What other major item do we normally get before Fantoon? Um... I mean, I guess X-Ray Scope is another one. Ice Beam, there it is. Uh, how do we get that over there, though? I mean, surely there's a way to, uh, take a peek at it, right? I'm sure there is. Over there, curious. Oh, speed block. Okay. Um, hmm. Can we even do this? No, not with all this water. Or, maybe, okay. we can do this. You freaking asshole! Ain't these seahorses! Wave! How did I forget wave? I was thinking of backtracking just to save. I think I'll do that. Not only for safety, but I kind of want to try something before going into the yellow door. It's gonna be out of sequence, I'm sure, but I'm just curious. I'm having fun with this. Let's see if I can short charge this. I want to say I could. Mm, oh, I don't know about that, Chief. <clears throat> we can short charge that like this way, but not the other way. Nah, can't happen. All right then. We'll play by the rules. I have no problem. <clears throat> so we're definitely fighting Fantoon next. <laughs> I hate those things, though. Uh... <clears throat> What's up here? I'm curious. Let's 
I think everything here is locked until we beat Fantoon. Yeah. I can respect that. Oh, why do you gotta make the room look like this, though? <clears throat> could potentially make Fantoon a tad problematic, actually. Hang on. <clears throat> Use this to my advantage. So we're getting gravity next, um, who knows what else. I'm sure we'll get a few toys here and there. Like in there, I can see this being a super missile. Nothing up there, is there? No. Nothing there. <clears throat> this right here is our gravity suit. Bam! <clears throat> well, now we can do the short charge out in the... what you call it? The... landing site. Before we do that, what's over here? Missile. Ow. Get through! Can I not get through this? No, not without damage boost. Ow. Oh, my God. 
Guess we can explore a little bit out like out here and stuff. Like what's over here? I mean logic says that leads to gauntlet. But let me go ahead and save here. That's a just in case. Anything here at all? No, no, okay. Here is probably nothing. I'm not going that way yet. You must be stupid. Stupid to think I'm going that way. See, this way leads to Meridia, I'm sure. Box room. Does that mean we'll get spring ball soon? I think we'll get spring ball soon. Ow! What the hell? Okay. You know what we never got? We never got x-ray scope, did we? Where could that be? Okay, yeah, that leads to Dragon. But I want... The... E-Tank. Give me that. Watch, there's gonna be exactly three E tanks in this hack for Mother Brain. We might go over there. I'm sure we can. <clears throat> Oh, super missile. Not much else. All right, let's fight Dragon, I guess. What kind of battlefield is this?
Yum yum, fried pho, Dragon. You think Dragon tastes like lobster? Or maybe shrimp? Asthma, wait. No space jump? <clears throat> yeah, I'll take plasma, sure, but no space jump? Okay. Whatever you say. No spring ball, no space jump. What next? No, no, uh, screw attack? That'd be sad. Oh, I get it. We need plasma beam for these pink pirates, even though they we can still beat them with either shine spark or um or pseudo screw. Speaking of screw, oh that's space jump. There it is. Funny that we get space jump after getting the the uh plasma. When it's ordinarily the other way around. I'm guessing in there is Gold Terizo. No Spring Ball yet. Screw Attack! No Spring Ball. <clears throat> We gotta kill everything here! Ow. No, dude! Not like this! You can't just do me like this! <laughs> How was I supposed to know? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I hope I don't have to kill everything. That'll make me sad. Okay, good. Hey! Gold Terizo! I've got an E-Tank. Isn't that lovely? Weird room, but I think we've seen this setup in Oyaji's other hack. Rodney! There you are.
This is not a very nice room to be in. Be dead yet. Okay, you're dead. Come here, grab me. <clears throat> oh. Mother brain is last, I guess. A save point at least. That's a save point, right? No, it's a refill. No spring ball. Um, I have to be careful. I have to be very careful going forward because if we have less than 300 health, that's just death. Perfect. See what I mean now? I hope the escape isn't too harsh. Spring Ball would have made the Mother Brain's room a little easier to navigate, though, if you ask me. Maybe Spring Ball is in this game and I just couldn't find it. Really?
Three minutes. Baby crates. Are they gonna die or what? Do I have to kill them? I do. fun. I actually had fun with this one. I'm gonna give this a 4. This is, this is definitely a solid 4 out of 5. Uh, the escape was not much different. Actually, the escape was almost exactly the same as um, another Super Metroid, except that weird baby crate room, which I thought was a neat little touch. Um, yeah, everything about this it was pretty well made. I, I I liked this. It was it was well thought out. I have nothing else to say. We saved the animals. Oh, oh, I get it. In the baby crate room, it was like a part of the wall that was broken off. Nice. I think that was supposed to be the original Bomb Torizo room or something, or it's coded to be Bomb Torizo's room during the escape. And breaking that wall near the baby babe means saving the animals. I don't know. We saved the animals without even realizing it. I mean, it only took several crappy hacks before we got to this one, right? And our rate for collecting items is 30%. I swear, Spring Ball is somewhere in this game, and I just don't know where. Oh well.